Hi guys, how are you doing? My name is Sebastian and welcome to my full review of the Maki Creative Reference for Multimedia Monitor Speakers. So in short, Maki just calls these uh, the CR4 and they also call them multimedia monitor speakers and not full-blown studio monitors, which would be of course a lot more expensive. Now, if we take a look at the availability and price, then you can get the CR4s here in Germany, starting at around 140 euros from various retailers. And in the US, you can get them for 149.99 US dollars, for example, from amazon.com. Now, in case you missed my separate unboxing video here on these speakers, uh, we find in the box not only the speakers themselves and all the necessary cables to actually hook them up, but also some free isolation pads. And they are supposed to improve the sound by avoiding vibrations on the surface that you put these speakers on. So it's great to see these in the box as well. Now let's continue with the design and the build quality of the CR4 speakers and overall I have to say I was very impressed especially considering the relatively low price uh, for these kind of speakers. We have a great very solid build quality, uh, no flaws visible also in the paint here on these speakers. Also the right active speaker is very heavy and just makes a very solid impression. Of course the left one is a lot lighter because it's just a passive speaker. Now by far the most polarizing aspect here of the design of these speakers are definitely the green accents around the drivers. And I've already seen in my unboxing video that a lot of people just plain don't like them. I have to say to me they look better online than they do in person. But still depending on the setup that you're planning, for example if you have a green themed gaming PC with for example a lot of uh, Razer accessories, then I think uh, these are a great match in terms of design. But of course in other environments, for example silver rings around the drivers would have been a better solution. But uh, these silver accents are actually just found on the more expensive Mackey speakers. Now in terms of ports and connectivity on the back we'll find TRS inputs, also RCA which is also known as Chinch. We also of course have a Chinch to 3.5mm cable uh, in the box itself. Then we also have a position select switch where we can actually change whether the active speaker is positioned on the right or the left. Now why this matters uh, we'll get to in a little bit. And then we also have a dedicated power on and off switch which is also very nice to see. Now one thing that I don't like is that the power cable is permanently attached to the speaker. So for example if you want to have a longer cable or if you just want to replace it because the cable is uh, defective then this is not possible. So this is probably my biggest gripe here in terms of ports and connectivity. Now on the front, then we will see on the right side a convenient volume control knob. And this can also be used to turn on and off these speakers. And then we also have an aux in as well as a headphone jack on the front. So I think that's also a very nice location here for these ports. And again, we can actually switch whether we want to have this active speaker on the right or the left side. So for example, if you prefer to have the headphone jack on the left, then you can just switch the speakers around, which I think is a great feature. But now let's get to the most important aspect about any speakers and that's of course the sound quality. And I have to say the CR4 absolutely blew me away. Despite the fact that there isn't a separate subwoofer, they still produce a nice amount of bass. Uh, with the two 4 inch drivers that you would find here in the speakers. And what's also nice about this is that the bass actually comes from both sides because both speakers actually have uh, these 4 inch drivers. And one thing that I've never experienced before from any speakers is that if you actually close your eyes while listening to music, it feels like uh, the band or the singer is right in front of you uh, instead of being on the left or the right side. So they just create an absolutely amazing stereo audio image in your head. And uh, that's something that I've only really experienced with headphones so far. So that's absolutely amazing. I also love the fact that we get these great isolation pads here in the box as well, not only to isolate vibrations, for example, uh, from getting to the speakers to the surface, but also just to be able to set these speakers up at the perfect angle. And you already see them here in the video as well, that I really positioned them so that the drivers of the speakers themselves really point to my ears. And that's when you get the best sound quality. 
Now, one thing that you have to be aware of is that they have a very neutral sound. So if you have a video file or also an audio file with bad quality, you'll hear this. These speakers won't cover this up. So these are the best if you actually have great sound quality or great material to begin with. And overall, in my opinion, they are great for music, gaming and movies. I didn't even see anything where they disappointed me in terms of audio quality. But now before I actually leave you guys alone with an audio demo of these speakers, let's get to my verdict. And overall, you probably already guessed that I have to say these are amazing speakers for the price. I was absolutely blown away. And first, when I really saw these speakers in person, I thought about actually sending them back because of the green accents, because it really wasn't my taste. But when I just started listening to it in a heartbeat, they convinced me and also convinced me to make this full review because they're just so great. And the build quality is also very good as well. So overall, I just have to say green might not be my favorite here on these speakers, but the sound quality is so worth it. And for 140 euros or 150 dollars, it's a very unique and just out of the norm speaker system uh, that is great and that I can just highly recommend. And I'm very happy with them and I don't plan on selling them anytime soon. And I'll probably just start building a green themed gaming PC to go along with them. So that's also my full review. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I'll leave a link to Amazon where you can buy these speakers in the description below. Now I'll have an audio demo of these speakers with a little bit of music to actually show you guys uh, how the audio quality is. Of course, always be aware that uh, this will be recorded with the Zoom audio recorder and then played back for your speakers. But just take my word for it, they sound absolutely amazing. And I really hope to see you guys in my next video. So if you like this one, please make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel for many more reviews in the future. My name is Sebastian and these were the CR4 by Maki. Oh, oh, oh.